let's talk about the best nutrient for improving your ability to learn. And I'm talking about a physical reason and nutrient deficiency creating this. Because there are a lot of other reasons why people can't learn simply because they've never been taught um, how to learn something. That's a whole different topic. I'm going to talk about what can happen in your body as far as a deficiency that can slow down or inhibit your ability to learn something. Well, it has to do with this structure in the brain called the hippocampus. Now, the hippocampus is a structure in the brain that has everything to do with learning and spatial memory, your ability to locate where you are in time and space and remember things like where you parked your car. To be totally transparent, they don't exactly know 100% what this does exactly, but it's associated with learning and memory and spatial memory. I just wanted to point that out. We know there's some type of connection with the hippocampus. And we do know that the omega-3 fatty acid, DHA, makes up 20% of the gray matter in your brain. And it really supports the retina. DHA is so important with your brain and your nervous system. And your retina is an extension of your brain. Okay, so it allows you to see. So DHA decreases oxidative stress. It decreases inflammation. It's a powerful antioxidant. It increases BDNF, brain-derived neurotrophic factors. This is something that helps your brain grow. It helps increase neurons. Also, DHA has the ability to increase the volume of your hippocampus. As you age, this structure shrinks and it can affect your learning and your memory. Also, when you're DHA deficient, this can also get smaller. Taking this omega-3, you can greatly support the hippocampus and improve your ability to learn. DHA is involved with synapses, the communication between the neurons. But what I also wanted to mention, if you're deficient in DHA, you could actually get ADHD, Attention Deficit Hyperactivity Disorder. There's a lot of research on that. I put some links down below. So if you know of someone that has this or dyslexia, have them start taking DHA. What DHA can do for a small child or even a baby is huge. A mother who's pregnant needs to take this fatty acid for sure. A mother who's breastfeeding needs to take it. The formation of the brain and the retina for a growing child depends on DHA. If an infant is not breastfed, they're fed formula. The entire structure, the makeup of the retina is completely formed differently than a child's retina with breast milk. The one really simple thing you could do is you could probably get it in a liquid, give it to your infant, give it to your kids. It can even influence IQ and the mental capacity of that child. And the best sources of DHA would be right here, fatty fish, cod liver oil, and you can also get it in algae. If you haven't seen my video on the brain, check it out. I put it right here.